What's up guys, this is the Roverman and I am back bringing you the next episode of my Napoleon Total War Let's Play as Great Britain. So to run off happened last time, we captured Berlin and we also captured Munich. Now these forces that are currently attacking um, Innsbruck are now looking mighty isolated. So rather than having lots and lots and lots of reinforcements coming their way, they're actually looking rather sticky. Actually you are... You're going to hold for now because I want to see what this chap does in relation to Berlin. But I'd like John Moore to move south to, to hit Prague. That would be lovely, I think. And we've also got an army to the south, working its way around through northern Italy to go and hit Vienna, probably having to engage Julian Hartmann on the way. Yeah, that was my capture Bavaria ward. Cool. It's not Howard Wood. Let's see if we can get him to sabotage Good. Well, I don't quite know what it achieves on the battlefield. Oh, Death Head Hussars, they're quite nice. Lots of 12 pounders. Well, two 12s and two 6s, lots of cavalry, solid amount of infantry, but a couple of garbage units in there. He can stay in there for now. Yep, yeah, that's my Brandenburg capture aboard. Sweet. Okie dokie, so I'm going to hit end turn and see what what tomorrow brings. More spies and agents are being brought up. Yeah, I'm keeping my eye on you, Austria. Oh no, the Austrians are going to try to go for Prague. Well, to be honest, if they do or if they don't, doesn't really matter, because we were going to go for it eventually anyway. So what is Prussia going to do? It looks like they're trying to gather together some kind of force to probably try to retake Berlin. Quite rapidly, actually. They're all they're really trying to put together something. Oh, they're gonna raid my No, they're not. I could ambush them if I wanted, but I don't think I will. Oh, don't hit Vienna. Good. So that army's grown in strength. They've pulled back. They've pulled back in all of Italy. Um, but yeah, if Austria takes Prague, that's not a problem. Because um, when I do take... Or when I do declare on um, Austria, which I will do... See, I hope they wish the Belgians would do something. But Trevor's they're not involved in any of my wars because they're super annoying. Meh. That's what happens, I suppose. Agent detected. Let's get mines on the go. Agent recruited another spy in London. So he will go south and join this army that's being recruited. So you get inside to Winston Ridge. Who can resist? Henry Paget. I know Henry Paget. There we go. Let's get you. Oh, he's bloody good as well. Gentlemen in Britannia. Oh, God alive. Okay, so let's. So, where are my other universities? One in Florence. So, if I've recruited all these gentlemen, I'm going to want to at least send these over to my other universities. Good. Spy in Brittany. Send him to Konigsberg. And another gentleman recruited in Denmark. God, we got lots of gentlemen. We're recruiting like hell. But you know, riflemen. Well, actually, no. Let's get King's King's German Legion light foot. Let's cross over into their territory. You gonna do something about this Prussia? You're gonna stand there and bleed. Of 
invincible Swiss Jaeger, Swiss Grenadiers. Screw a handful of Swiss Grenadiers and get ready to send them north to hit Ernst Braun. So it's tempting because you've got not got a terrible garrison as she could. So if I bring you down here, you can instead push. push this way to try and make it to Prague, although I suspect they'll make it first, but that's okay. It's recruitment in English, England, Venice and Hanover, great supply post, ordnance born in Marseille. Yeah, they're raiding the farms, but that's okay, we are now fully replenished. General available. Yep, we've already recruited him. Good stuff. Okay, so what I might want to do is take my frigate navy. Although no one's currently trading out of here. Oh yes, you were to go back to you were to deploy your army back to Copenhagen because he is knackered and he's he is going to replenish like hell. Get him inside my main fleet. You need replenishing. Good stuff. Factory, let's upgrade you. Okay, so you've already got your rifles. Get two units of foot guards. Ah, come on. I think it's. No, it's nine units of infantry. Well, do you have any howitzers? You do have howitzers, and you've got solid nine pounders. Good. So, what gets me, or well, can I get twelve pounder artillery at all? Standardized artillery gets me gunnery school, which gets me six inch fire twelve experimental. Nope. Nines are as good as it gets. Still not bad though, really. Okay, now let's not forget my obligations as a British person to keep recruiting merchantmen. So what's trading currently at the top dollar? Ivory. Oh, the ivory's down here, isn't it? Yes, it is. So let's put these merchantmen on. Well, let's put two of them on ivory. See how that changes the, the trade order of bit things. Nope, still ivory, just more ivory. And let's upgrade you. Oh, finally, finally spent all my money. So the Russians are taking everything, <laughs> everything they can. So I mean, we soon need to be careful. <laughs> Edward Packenham, cross-eyed Packenham. Uh, you're on the move, you're on the move. Everyone's on the move. Innsbruck is still, turns to surrender too. So if I give Wellesley another chance to, re to reinforce or to replenish, he can then uh, be the relief. The relief coming from the south. Good. I really don't like this one bit. I don't like how the Austrians are running through my territory. Oh, big! Oh, there's lots of lancers. Yeah, they're spamming basic units. That's all they've got. They need to. They want to get some sort of army to the south rapidly, but there's nothing they can do. Aha, a general. Interesting. We'll be having a look at to see who that is. Oh yeah, this is all, all troops coming out of Königsberg. <gasps> oh, do I send my army in England to capture Königsberg? Maybe. Maybe. 
Okay, they've just walked in directly in the way of the army that's up near Hanover that's going to go try to intercept Prague. So they've unwittingly walked straight into my troops. Their demand... No, 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 no. I'm not going to declare on the French just yet. I'm not going to break my trade agreement with Portugal. I don't want you involved in the war against Prussia. We're doing just fine. I don't want you expanding westwards any more than you already have, Russia. This is Cold War doctrine kicking in. Building sabotaged. Okay, well you very nicely walked in the way of my chaps, so... Just knock him out. Killed lots of men, but we've got a few turns left to go through our own territory. Steam dry dock in Normandy. Agents of spies are en route. Let's try to steal my tech again. John Moore, glorious general. Plus four to command in land battles. Holy hell, he is really good. This is a really good general. Absolutely do not want him to get killed. Is he more higher ranked than Wellesley now? He's Wellesley's equivalent, just. So we've got one turn to surrender, so I'm going to hit you first. So I just want to check where places we're going. Yeah, you infiltrate Budapest. Yeah, I don't like this. So let's do a bit more of this. Start to build up another force in Milan. Or do I just bring... Well, he is no longer needed here. So let's see if he can retreat. Let's bring him back to Venice. And that's what pretty, God damn, that's like a full army there now. You continue to ride continue to raid on your way towards their region so this territory this port is no longer needed to be guarded who's there mecklenburg strelitz don't worry bernie at some point we are going to get you we're not going to we're not just going to let you live there forever in peace and harmony can't afford it can't let you because we tried it before didn't we and you just came back so let's check all our roads are top notch Milan's are pretty bad wait a minute oh they can't get metal roads I suppose because it's meant to be too hilly or something is the the logic you could do with getting a unit of nines okay actually what you could do with is if I got rid of not got rid of but get rid of that unit of six pounders and get two units of nines let's drop the 28th and the 20th or maybe the two weakest units 34th and the 25th they go to Copenhagen and then let's get some 5 inch howitzers let's get Michael Stowell some more artillery yep, infantry is en route so how do you go you got yep, your guards will be recruited and that will be you soon Okay, so trading um, ivory and sugar. Yeah, ivory and sugar. Sugar is up. They've got some sugar up here, don't I? Or is it down? Sugar. Under there. Mm, you've 
think I just got to cotton. How my minister's looking, okay, I could do with a better minister of the army now. Stuart Eden. Let's get rid of that. I can't fire any more people. Okie dokie. Let's upgrade you, and then let's take Wellesley and hit Adolf Selig. <gasps> oh, nuts! Oh, no! No, 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 not Wellesley, not Wellesley in an ambush. Oh, no. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> oh, no, poor Wellesley. Wellesley's gonna die. Caught in a Prussian ambush. Tell you what, that was, as, as, as frustrating as that is, that's bloody clever AI. Okay, see where it's... Okay. Okay, so forgive me if I don't talk for about a few minutes. To be honest, they're all mostly... Okay, hold on. Cavalry, kick in. Set my guns up. Now you guys need to go here. You guys go, like, here. Hit the general staff. Engage their general. Form squares. You run on and hit their guns. It's going to be very sticky on this flank for them. Oh, yes. Okay, so these two broken units, not broken units, but Teller, isn't it? Meh. Yeah, fair enough.
just gun the artillery around and away. That's my cavalry, but that's okay. Grenadiers up on the hill. Come on, let's run this regiment of, regiment of horse. Those are my guns somewhere. Meh. Fine. Run them into the flank. Oops. Okay, let's start to consolidate our lines a bit because we're getting a bit stretched out. Break the howitzers. Wellesley's taking shots. Fire will, lads. Yeah, they can safely target those men up on the hill. Set up to attack the Swiss line. Whew. Getting up into our faces to try and bayonet charge us. Risky strategy, sir. You guys should route in good order, because you cannot be able to match our firepower. Good, and they're broken. Those units are routing, but that's fine. I never mind men running as long as they come back. Halt a limba. Let's push up. Grenadiers are falling back, got enemy musketeers. And 
these chaps will be fired on by my 6th Regiment of Foot. Play it safe. Musketeers going to be being fired down along the flank. How many good Prussian men must die? Okay, now let's send a whole fire on my artillery. Good, and they've routed. Continue. Let's make them suffer for this. Good man. So Wellesley, you need to get the hell out of there now. He's lost lots of good aides in his in his divisional staff. Send these guys over here because somewhere there's a. Yep, yeah, there they are. These guns are shattered, but they're not leaving. Yeah, they're still routing. Eager, eh? Then you can run in. Ooh, and these men have. They're not sure which way to route, so which means Wellesley has a chance to come in and clear them out. There we go. Come on, Wellesley. Clear them out. There we go. Okay, let's run away. And then back. Run away. Back. Let's run away. Back. Take out those four, preferably. Because he's the last scum on the field. God, I see for... Oh, come on. Go on. I don't care. If they, if they can't kill one Prussian... Two Prussians. One Prussian left. There he is. That's the only guy on the field you need to kill. Good. Well, I'm not going to last Prussian uh, uh, ambush. I'd be absolutely screwed. But fortunately, they decided to stand off and try and shoot me. So we, they lost more than us. Fall back. So we require two units of artillery. To be honest, I might just recruit. Uh, no. Uh. Let's recruit two nine pounders. Doesn't mean that we have to bring Alexander Abercrombie. 
out to Sally. But at least that means there isn't a hidden ambush army that's going to cause problems. So let's do it. Because we have to do it. I know the time has ticked over half an hour. This is a... Well, I'm going to try, where possible, to make the 10 episodes, the multiple, to be a uh, one hour special. That's what I'd like to try to do. Um, sometimes it doesn't kind of work out, and I end up playing <laughs> episodes of an hour here and there anyway. But in general, that's what I'd try, like, like to try and do. Okay, so they're over there. Oh wait, they've already... Oh! Okay. Six pounders. Pick a nice. Oh, okay, I might need to deploy my artillery first and then do my... Infantry as and when. So they'll take the centre. One, two, three. And then let's, let's deploy my lights just like this because I'm not quite sure what to do with them. Stretch my lines out. Send all my guns to barrage. Oh, okay, they're coming from back here, eh? In which case, let's run one of my light infantry units up here to garrison the this section of the wall. Let's bring my lights in. Let's probably put my cav in the centre. Probably gonna want to do something like this now, because they're being very, very nice and bearing in mind, I suppose, that the big army is gonna come from over here somewhere. Unfortunately, there is no victory point for the center. So I think I'm actually gonna to want to do this. Put my real infantry there, light infantry here. Because at least these infantry can form square. like what I'm probably going to do almost immediately. Then when these get into position, I will form sky with them too. Form square. Come on men, you guys take positions on the wall. Hopefully this cavalry should get broken apart against my squares. Good, a mass cavalry route. Coming in again. Turn fireball on, so at least they can get some shots off at the cavalry.
to be honest, I'm probably going to want to limber these guys up. Run my light infantry away. Yep, yeah, it's fair enough. They're being shot at from all directions, but this cavalry is going to have a torrid time of it. Enemy general's been killed. Get my other light foot up on this section of the wall. Nope, you form square again, because they're going to come in. Cover over here to support these attacks. You hit the grenadiers, you just go in and hit the artillery. Some weak lancers are coming in, but they're not going to be enough. go after them actually these infantry will pick through the the gun crews mm, they're wearing my squares down so let's yeah as you would expect they have been pounded into oblivion Get ready to set up a new defensive line. Or do I just go in and save them? I think I go in and save them. Oh yes, these men have come back. Maybe we don't. Maybe we do just set up a new defensive line. Engage them in hand to hand combat. Can has to shot and barrage the crap out of them.
charging these guns. Not anymore, they're not. Let's unlimber the guns. Set up my nice neat line again. Ready to receive the next charge. <laughs> Did you hear that voice? This is bloody dangerous, Sarge. Just go straight into him. Straight into the straight into the hearts into the people. Okay, let's just get get people up on the wall if they're feeling unhappy. Deploy all my troops slightly to the side of where they actually are. I've got some reserves. Jaeger, so we can't sit back against Jaeger, we're gonna have to we either push up or we get our artillery in position. Oh no, they might just be within range of this flank if I push them up slightly. There we go. Yep, they're within range. maximum use of all the artillery given to me. Okay, you might have to get something like that, because right now I'm not bringing my full firepower to bear. Mm, deployed stakes, so they're preparing for a bit of combat. There you go, my guys should chew them, eat them alive. Chew them apart. I don't know. Push the line, I suppose. Get the infantry involved. Get all my infantry involved. Shot to pieces. They got nothing. <laughs> Someone's doing some rubbish outside. They're charging in to attack. Yeah, they're damn right they're gonna route. Then when these guys make ready.
pushing that. Just let them pour fire into their ranks for a while. Yeah, that's the guns from the artillery from the fort kicking in. It's a nice massive cluster of artillery. It might cause my infantry to break actually trying to kill them all. We are doing a lovely job in pushing them back. It's a massive route. So we absolutely want to try and take the position if we can. To bayonet charge this regiment of foot. So we're 40 dragoons against a lot of troops, really. Although they can't, most of them can't really fire because if they did, then they'd kill everyone else. General into gear. Hmm, that's one unit routed. It's a unit routed and gone. New men go and engage that musketeer unit. It's gone into square. My like that's all the artillery routed. Maybe just get Alexander Abercrombie back over here. Let's turn off all these units fire at will, because I think they're doing more harm than good. Ooh. Good. And that will soon be it, I think. Once we knock out these musketeers. Lovely stuff. Yep, these are the last guys remaining. Good stuff. Let's end of there. Pyrrhic victory, it's not Pyrrhic. destroy a lot of their troops and they're put they're being pushed back good and that gives us some breathing space let's get a foot unit to replace whatever was whatever was lost or oh, actually I won't get a unit of let's get a unit of light dragoons good because now they're at our mercy in this part of the map you're still heading towards Prague you are heading well, you want, I want to wait to see what these Prussians do, because I might just engage them. And the Austrians are being sneaky, or potentially being sneaky. Okay, I'm waiting to see what these guys do. Because now these guys are replenished. Walls will be in three turns, but I doubt they will have three turns of peace. So who are you? <gasps> Blucher! Blucher is in the woods! Okay, so do I want to do something like this? 
move this move uh, Henry Clinton up to Berlin as a reinforcing army bring my Hanover garrison to secure this bridge in the event they try to cross I think that's probably a good thing to do oh yeah we've already seen that sabotage okay let's hit oh, our research and tech is still going good let's hit in turn our gentlemen are still on the march gentlemen and spies that we've recruited from across the land okay is the Austrians still on the move I really don't like how they're crossing into my territory because we're not allies so are we allies I don't think we are allies okay they're forming an actual army to the, to the south Yeah, why not? Lost a lot of men. <laughs> so here come. Oh, Luke has gone to the south. Interesting. Maybe he'll seek to cross the river. Ooh, finally a navy. Well, I'm going to have to absolutely blow them out of the water because I can't afford to let them do anything. No. Oh, they've, they've snuck through. Nuts. Okay, I'll bring my the guy who was garrisoning Milan back up to the north to ambush them, or to, to destroy them. So let's take two of you chaps. Yeah, second and a third against probably a, a, a frigate. Eight against ship the line. Well, I'm still just going to water it. And I'll take it. And this gate has no guns, so let's put into put into Calais for repairs. Then we'll send you back to the fleet next turn. And I'm going to take that as a bit of a suggestion. So I've got my Karen airships. You go to Goldberg. My main fleet. Go hit. No way, not you. Not my fencibles. George Elphinstone. Go hit Lepaya. Is that Lithuania? What would, be, what would currently be Lithuania? Uh, merchantmen inside. Okay, good. Good buildings. Frankfurt Supply Depot. Very useful. Two turns. Till we get... Till we get walls, but I suspect... Uh, Beluka is not going to give us that opportunity. But instead... Okay, here's the gamble. Do I... use a merchantman to do this transport task. So to get embark them in Portsmouth. Embark my army. What range have you got? Not very far. Still, hop over to Chatham Docks to at least make some progress. Let's get my militia back in the port. Oh, my agent's still, but still there. Oh well. Um, let's put. Let's just send my merchantman to go on to goods. Kidoki, like Stowell, is. He is in very good nick, so I might bring you back. Embark him back onto the ships and then get ready to send him back to Germany. Maybe up in this dock I might want to create. Okay, let's get two, three firsts. 
some seconds and some thirds. 80 gun thirds. Good. Trade route raided, dealt with, spy network established in Vienna. Lovely. So they currently have. I've got two spies in here. Dang. Okay, let's put you in here. Infiltrate. Diplomacy Austria. So they're indifferent. I'm going to cancel military access. There we go, that's punted them out. William de Dornberg. Come back north and hit the Ralph Habersack. He's retreated. Well, that's enough. Go hit engage Philip Engel. Yeah, quick capture. Then John Moore goes straight on to Prague to engage it next turn. Wells, who take this high ground, I almost want to force them to go east. So he's getting two units of artillery. And let's get a five inch howitzer. It's going to take some time to bring the guns up. Good. Court of Appeals. Cool. And then let's. Hit end turn and see what happens. Gentlemen's on the move to Florence. Spies on the way to Budapest. Oh, hello. Gentlemen's on the march, as will my spy soon. I can see two buildings that need to be upgraded, or that can be upgraded. So you have no reason to cross my territory, Austria. And I wonder if that's going to be the spark that drives us to war. Because they see what they. Because they can't be a war of the Prussians, because the Prussians would have done something, I'm sure. Now, what I want is that army, the Prussian army in the university north of the shore, to pull out and head back to Venice, and I could lay siege to Venice. Perfect. Okay. Prussians are still moving up. Yep, they're pulling back to the east. I think the army north of Innsbruck is... I think he's just waiting. Which is fine. Um, I'll let these guys replenish and then they'll engage him on the field. Don't want to move them out of Munich yet because it might give them an opportunity to capture it. You're the artillery that's going to Wellesley. Nice. You move late siege to Prague, just out of range. Can I get a general? James Inglis Hamilton. Then let's bring up a pair of bring up a pair of nine pounders for you. Because I want this guy. Um, he can be an army that will follow follow my main armies to do mopping up and then other smaller tasks. Good. One more turn till I get general staff, which means I I think I might just play this extra turn. Lots of experience on all my troops. Get the 10th Hussars. 15th, costume guards, lifeguards, horse guards. Have I got horse guards? I don't think I've got horse guards. So then, okay, hold on. So let's bring. Okay, let's send a fifth rate scout. This Koningsberg is ripe for the taking. Or, oh, this is an area of attrition because it's winter. Okay. So let's take. Hmm. Hmm. 
Michael Stoll can wait, or wait for the weather to break before launching an, an attack in Eastern Europe. So let's take my merchantman over here. He can go. Let's go to Stavanger. So we've got armies waiting, ready to move, because I'd like to hit Courland and Konigsberg to provide the Eastern threat. Even though I did say I wouldn't want them to go around in this direction. Which actually, I'm, now I'd, I'd want a nice strong fleet to go to escort them all around. So, so I'm not currently explore, exploit, experiencing replenishment problems. Let's hit end turn again. So I think this turn might be the turn I get walls in Berlin. There goes my artillery on the move to go to support Wellesley. Oh, I didn't move my army to hit Vienna. Dang it. At least if I capture Vienna, it will force them not to use the main um, highway network to join their front. They'll instead have to go south um, across open ground and over the bridge. Oh no, they're suffering. Oh, my my um, ambushes are suffering from attrition. Okay, they're going to raid probably and be frustrating little scamps. If you want to join, if you want to join the war against Prussia, just to be honest, I don't like the fact that they are terrifying, power terrifying, and well spectacular. So I don't, I still don't want them to be involved. And I don't know why they've got such a massive gripe against the French because they just, they just have their own tiny little island. And sure, it's probably an annoying little island. General stuff. I want him to come up here to engage, to intercept Christoph Hempf. Go hit Vienna. Because they're not currently in the cold pit. So let's move them out. Silly Alps. So is there any sort of trade? Russia and Sicily is going around this way. Good. Berlin is now fortified. Attack me at your peril, Berliners. Although they've all moved. Maybe they... I don't know. Do they get attrition here? I don't know. All of this is area of attrition, so I don't want to attack. No way. They're sabotaging my army. Let's take these merchantmen and then just drop them on some of the more exotic goods. You're in a good position, ready to hit the ready to blockade the Portuguese navy so they don't want to, to leave the safety of their ports. Court of Appeals in Torino. Yeah, yeah. We've sorted it. Good roads. Hanover roads. Starform Berlin. Logging camp. Good. Another agent detected, of course. So then London, build a staff college, and I'm going to sneeze. <laughs> Apologies for that, guys.
Um, but yes, things seem to be going rather well. I think what I'm going to do is attack Prague and then probably end the turn there and make this the opening action for the next part. So, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you've enjoyed, and we'll see you next time for the assault on Prague. Alright, cheers.